What's up guys? Here's my backyard. We're gonna go over Adamax today, man. I'm gonna give you guys a little different opening. Cause I suck at making videos, man. Not my thing, all right? All right, just doing this to help you guys out, man. I don't never ask for likes, never ask for follows, man. Just, just doing, that's why I don't post too many videos, man. I do like one video of uh, each peptide and, and that's it, man. Just to let you, get you all started, man. Get going on your own, all right? So let's do it. Adamax, we're gonna hack the brain, hack the brain peptide. All right. Strong improvement of cognitive abilities, neuroprotection, and neurogenesis, all right? So here's my notes on C-Link, C-Max. I tried C-Link, didn't do anything for me. Tried C-Max, but I did injection. I didn't, apparently this stuff is better uh, nasally, all right? Did C-Max also, injection, didn't notice anything from it. So, um, Adamax, so Adamax is supposed to be like, um, C max, but it's supposed to be like five, five times or ten times stronger, something like that, right? And then uh, here's some other ones that we have here: ARA nine two ninety ten milligrams and cerebralisin. Don't get the cerebralisin. You need a, you need a big doses for this one, and and that's like insane expensive. Don't even waste your time. Okay, so Adamax, let's go over it. Adamax is C max. But with two additional groups added to the molecular structure to make it cognitive, uh, cognitive enhancing properties even more potent than the original peptide. In terms of dose, ser uh, Serotropic recommends uh, 100 to 200 micrograms a day for the nasal spray bottle that has 10 milligrams of Adamax, uh, which is roughly t 100 doses, assuming that you have 10 cc's, a uh, 10 cc bottle with 0.1 ml per spray which comes out to one to two sprays okay don't worry guys i got you covered on this one this one took me a few months to figure out but i finally got it all right i'm gonna put a link uh on amazon on which uh vials or which uh uh, uh bottles to here let me just show you here that's it i don't need to get a cal calculator out because we're, we're gonna break this down all right so I found on Amazon that this one gives you, it says you gives you the dose of 0.1, uh, uh, 0.1 uh, milligram per dose. And I, we want, what did it say we want? We want 0.1, 100 micrograms, right? 0.1 cc is gonna give you 100 micrograms. Okay, right. So 0.1, so basically if we mix 10 cc's of bacterial stat water into that vial over there, all right, and put in 10 milligrams of Adamax, one spray is gonna give us 100 micrograms. You guys follow that? If we do two sprays up the nose, you're gonna get 200 micrograms, okay? So I'm gonna cut this in half, okay, because I like to keep my peptides more potent instead of sitting in that, in that vial so long because it, you're gonna get a hundred doses out of that. So you're basically, I mean, if you do that, that's what, uh, 30, like, dude, that's almost like three months at, at, if you put, so, cause I have five milligram vials of Adamax, okay? So I might as well just mix this in half at five milligrams and I'm gonna get like a month and a half and then I can mix up a fresh new vial of peptides of five milligrams into it. That way they don't, the, they don't degrade over time. You know what I'm saying? So here's some other stuff about it. Uh, P21, that's another one. All right, here's some other um, stuff that I found online, right? Adamax increases focus, verbal uh, acuity, same as CMAX, but less anxiety of uh, sides. It can cause brain fog with long-term dosing. Adalink, C-Link uh, is a nopa, nopogenic that decreases anxiety with mild focus or with mild increase in focus. This dude said it was his favorite. Uh, Celebra diet, yeah, we're not going over those. So those are basically some uh, information that I found. You can pause it and read those if you want. So let's try to mix this, mix this up, man. Let's do this. Let's help me, chicken. All right. So I have five milligrams of Adamax right here. 
even though that same thing was saying mix five, uh, 10 milligrams into, into here, right? If I mix 10 milligrams into here, then I need 10 cc's. But since I have five milligrams and I like to keep my stuff more potent, I'm just gonna do five milligrams in and with five cc's of back water, okay? So let's mix this up, man. Be easy. We're gonna use, all right, here's what I got here. Put this over here, this over here. All right. So, if you don't have a, a larger CC syringe, which it's completely fine, you don't need one, all right? Here's a 10 CC. Big fat sucker, right? Let me add a needle so I can do this all in one shot. If you don't have a large CC syringe, don't worry about it. You don't need it. All you need is just your little one CC syringe over here. But you you have to put in, so if I'm, we're gonna mix five CCs in here, you're, you're gonna have to draw this. Oh shit. You're gonna have to, there we go. How's that look? You're gonna have to draw this up five times and put it in here, all right? That's the only difference there. Five times on the one CC syringe, put it in here. Or if you got a bigger CC syringe, I'm just gonna draw this up to five. Five would be right there, small. Okay, so let's do it. And we're gonna have to, so we're gonna have to extract all of this out of here into here, all right? So let's see, I don't wanna, let's see, I kinda wanna keep the tip of this clean as possible. So here, let me see if I can stick it here. There we go. I stuck it there, hanging out in the air, right? All right, let me crack this. Here's my Atomax, five milligrams. Clean. And clean. So I'm gonna pull up five. Put in five. Five cc's of air and pull up. So I like to pull up extra, as you can see here. I pull up extra. That way I can push the air out to right where I want it, right there. That's five cc's. Any air bubbles in? Yeah, I do got an air bubble in there. Hold on. So let me let me pull back more. All right. Get the air bubbles out. There we go. That's it. Air bubbles are out. Oh wait, no, 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 no. That's completely wrong. No, I'm wrong. Wait. <laughs> Oh wait, let me start over and put this back in. I don't know. That was sorry. That was a half cc, dude. Five. Here we go. Five cc's up to here. My bad, guys. I was wondering why it seems so small. All right. Yeah, so I'm gonna leave a link on Amazon where I found these because I went searching like on Amazon crazy and none of them give you a dosage of how much per spray is, but this one I found it did and it worked out perfect for this protocol. All right, so I'm pulling past five, right? So that I can push out, get rid of all the air, okay? Boom, there we go, look, five. Five, right on the money, see that, okay? All right, so now we have to, let me wipe it. Okay, now we have to extract everything out of here 
and mix all this together and then just put it in here and then we're done man it's that easy trust me it wasn't easy it took me a few months to figure out I had to, actually had to go on reddit and there was some good information on reddit and how these guys said how to mix that stuff up so basically that's it man so I'll just wait for this mix it up I don't have to put all the food in there. I just put as much food as I want in there. Because in the end, it's all going to mix up anyways. All right. Looks like it's mixed up, right? I'll see. Look at that. All pretty much mixed up. All right, so let's pull this all back out. There it comes. Look, there it is, all of it. Okay. I have a little bit left in there. Let's see if I can get it. You know what? Here. I'm just going to put this in here right now. It. Let me see if I can get the rest of this out here. Put a little bit of air in. Tip it upside down. Probably not. Probably not gonna be able to get it. It's all right though. All right, I got it. Got it. Empty. Nothing left in there. So I'll just put the rest in here. There you go, man. Check it out. And that's it. Check that out, man. Now I got Atomax, five milligrams. So every spray that I do nasally is gonna be 100 micrograms. Boom. Done. All right, guys. Uh, remember, in all of my videos, I try to put a peptide calculator in there. So on the video description, you can check out the pipe, uh, cal uh, calculator. And I also put the protocol in the description. So if you ever have, want to reference it, you can just check that out, man. All right, guys. Thanks for checking it out, man. Catch you all later. Hands up brain, baby. See you.